Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dean Hop Realtors. Well, I'm back out the beautiful community of Crossvine, right behind Randolph Air Force Base in Shirts, Texas. And I have a David Weekly home that's a pre-existing home that is on the market and have clients that are very interested in putting an offer on it. But before they do, I'm gonna do a video tour of it. So let's go check it out. This is a beautifully done home. I think it's uh, built in 2017, so it's not very old but i absolutely love the crossbind community it's like i said right behind the randolph air force base and gives you wonderful access right down i-90 slash 10 which is just a little bit that way to get you to lackland what you see in front of us is the founders classical academy school right there you do have uh the rose garden elementary school and corbett middle school just up uh 15 18 here all right, let's go check out the inside. Loving the colors of this house. Now this is someone's home. So I'm gonna do my best not to infringe on their privacy by taking a lot of pictures of, I mean, videos of other stuff that just don't need videoing. But this is a beautiful home. They do have an office slash playroom area right up front. Loving the wrought iron banisters. Nice cabinets. Good sized corner pantry. This is a gas community. Nice little slow view of the area. Loving the pendant, pendant lighting there. And lots and lots of cabinet space in this house. I not, no soft clothes. The high windows there it's kind of a david weekly thing they want you to be able to still use the wall instead of just having all windows there but they put these windows in just so you can get extra light too but check out this vaulted ceiling in the main living space All right, you do have a really large covered patio with two fans on it. Nice sitting area. And if you've watched any of my other videos about cross -fime, they have the same uh, rock features on the backs of the houses, just like the front, because, well, because they don't have the privacy fences, they have these vines so people can see your backyard. That's not for everybody, but that's one of the requirements to build in this community. But since this house is a couple years old, these vines are quite mature, so you still have some nice little bit of privacy. Now this is door coming in from the garage. You do have a little mud room, backpack area. All right, we are back at it again. This is right about where my GoPro cut out on me. I will show you the utility room. This 
the garage. Like I said, you do have some storage section over here, but overall it's a uh, pretty tight garage. Ooh, nice water filtration system though. You do have the uh, a full bathroom. And this is that down the only downstairs bedroom, which would be a perfect guest bedroom with a really nice closet. All right, now we're going to actually go upstairs. There's another realtor here, so bear with me. All right, here is our view from above. Let me get some more lights on in here. This is that extra room. Showing where you could have your TV port, but this is like a nice little community room. With the two other bedrooms tucked away to the side. Once again, still pretty tall ceilings in here. The other bedroom. I like the colors they painted. And this will be the communal bath. Framed mirrors, very nice. And then this is the third bedroom that's on this wing. Beautiful sticker there. All right, now let's go ahead and check out the owner suite across the catwalk. Well, kind of a catwalk. Like the little paneling they have on the back wall here. This also gives you a good view of what the area around you will look like. It is the three-dimensional uh, upgraded shingles here, but uh, you can see the yards. You're definitely not looking straight in the back of somebody just because of the way they did it. the uh, cul-de-sacs here. Quite nice. Dig the lighting in here. And once again, there's more of those David Weekly arches that they like so much. A double vanity. Really large soaking tub. Water closet off in the corner. And a really big shower. I wouldn't say really big, but bigger than normal. And this is that decent sized closet. Not the biggest, but a cool light.
All right, that's gonna wrap a tour of this pre-existing home built by David Weekly in the Crossvine community. I hope you found it useful in making a decision on whether or not you wanna put an offer on this house or not. If you got any questions, I'm here for you and I'm happy to help. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now, bye.